Fight. What up, it's your boy NWP, and today we got some gameplay from the new game mode, Endurance. Yeah, you got clickbaited a little bit. But listen, hear me out, and like listen to what I got to say in the video. But before we get into my topic, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, take the time right now to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell just next to it so that you can get alerted anytime that I drop a new video. If you like this video at any time, hit the thumbs up, and if you have any comments, suggestions, or feedback, drop them in the box below. Now, additionally, I'm running some giveaways so that you guys can get a hold of COD points, V-Bucks, whatever. 50 bucks, your favorite gaming currency. Link in the description. Check it out. It's up to you. You don't have to. All right. So, for the last, mm, I don't even know how many years. Was it 15 years of COD? We've had pub stomping and competitive COD, pretty much. Well, actually, no. You, do, you could say that we've only had pub stomping for the entire duration of COD as there really wasn't a competitive scene in Modern Warfare 4 till towards the end or Modern Warfare I should say COD 4 until the end <clears throat> right around the time that you started to see um, like Halo gain a lot of popularity um, on YouTube because Twitch wasn't a thing yet but it was like people were really into the like competitive scene and this is what really you know ended up climaxing with Black Ops 2 in my opinion um, then you know causing a little bit of overhype with ghosts and so on and so forth those kind of things but the real principle here is that pub stompers do completely different things than uh, a pro player a pro player is going for the win that's their goal their objective is to get the win as fast as they can a pub stomper is trying to get as many stats as they possibly can per game now the difference being there is that a, a pro wants the game to be over immediately and a pub stomper wants the game to can last as long as possible now realistically speaking if you're paying, playing a public match enjoying yourself slaying out you probably would want the match to continue going right sounds like it makes sense to me you know like where you got to be what do you got to do that's got you moving around you know got you know like what you got to go to bed bedtime it's just like you know i said hurry up finish your game you know so uh with the new endurance mode more or less what we've received is a game mode where you can play with anyone and you're going to get the time allotted to really drop pub stomper style gameplays in a sense so if you don't have a, uh, even a three man or you know five man six man whatever to really <clears throat> control the map and control the time and stuff like that like a full six man that knows what they're doing really can do or five man in this game I should say but everybody knows what I'm talking about if you're familiar with Call of Duty pub stomping in that people like to see big high killing games and you can only get so many kills in you know a 200 point dom game or if you were to just go out there and double cap or triple cap and win so you'll see pub stompers use uh different methods to get not only uh an elongated game like to the maximum duration of the game which is more or less what this is a maximum duration game but the concept is is that they'll make it so you know you'll use tricks to make the team cap you know your enemy team I, I am and talking about specifically to make the enemy team capture objectives or move spawn points to better benefit you know the team or the single individual that the team is feeding to get a really crazy gameplay now don't get it twisted by any means a lot of the times in the background of any gameplay you see and that is a full team working to get one person's you know uh, crazy video done and that's the way that a lot of video structure has to be because it's really not that easy to do a lot of these things and some some of the things are downright impossible like a solo you know 200 point kill game you know like a 200 kill game in Dom solo it's probably like just out of reach in reality and there's probably just not gonna be enough time you know, and the pub, you know, the pubs that you have in there would probably have to, uh, <clears throat> basically, they would have to play as if you were a six man and they knew you, and that's not going to happen very often, if ever. 
So, you know, most of the time you're going to at least see a double cap in a pub. And a double cap will end a dom game long before you can get that many kills because just by respawn, um, you know, the one second like respawn delay, which you know is your own hand being able to get through the menus and stuff like that. But it's about a second, maybe two seconds before you respawn back up. Now the thing about endurance here is endurance is actually giving us a game mode where it's maxed out basically by just the, the game itself is maxed out. Now, there is some stuff in here that's definitely awesome. 150 point TDM can be really fun, but that depends on how both teams are playing. If both teams are really campy, it's going to be a long, long game, and they should have thought about this um, and maybe buffed in TDM the, the amount, like make it 125 per kill. Because and, and this is just because of how long the games can actually go on. Now this video I'm going to leave like basically raw and uncut in the duration so that you guys can, if you want to, you can watch the entire video and get an idea of how long a hard point game can go when and stuff like that. And <clears throat> basically you get an idea of what is really going on uh, behind the scenes here, you know what I mean, with Treyarch. Now I don't know what other events they got planned but obviously they got this idea from Fortnite to keep adding in you know limited time modes and stuff like that which hey I don't mind it I think it's pretty fun to add something unique some flavor to the uh, game before it gets stale and actually you know showing us what they're gonna be doing this early is really really cool now where it can go I don't know are we gonna start seeing like really corny game modes probably you know like I could do without seeing zombies or you know any of that type of game mode where it's you know or hide and seek you know michael myers i could do without that you know it was cool to see gun game and <clears throat> and uh you know like the chaos mosh pits that's really nice to see them bring in the mercenaries i don't think that those should be limited time modes mercenaries should be allowed uh at any given time but uh yeah guys i am gonna step out of here because this is a long video and uh, I got 127 kills, but just running around. I don't really have any good streaks yet. Um, I just, like just unlocked strike team again, uh, so it's limited. And then I couldn't, you know, because I had two helicopters, I could only get one up at a time. So really, I kind of, I was, pr I'm really limited on how much uh, streak killing I can do at any like, like spam wise. If you know what I mean, like I can't just get like a mantis, you know, a thresher and a chopper up and have them, do, you know, work in the whole battlefield. At right at the moment, I can only get a turret and you know one chopper up at a time. And turrets, while actually can be amazing, at the same time, sometimes just pepper the targets up and don't do any damage. So you know what I mean, guys. Like it's a double-edged blade here, and uh, yeah, I'm still working on uh, you know getting diamond camos and dark matter. What I haven't done is worked on any since uh, right in, like the day before Nuketown came out. So good day, Monday, Monday since Sunday basically I haven't done anything towards uh, camos. I've just been playing for fun, and uh, yeah, man, remember, don't stack up with your teammates and run in a door in a line. You'll all get killed. This is your boy NWP signing out. Enjoy the rest of the video, gangsters.
Authorizing attack chopper tasking. Hostile. Eliminate. Hard point is secure. above. UAV circling. UAV 
detected. Enemy UAV above. Identified. Our point locked down. Tested. is secure. Hellstorm launch. Authorization torque.
enemy CUAV established above. Hostile UAV circling. Hard point is secure. RCXD out. Testing hard point. Hostiles have the hard point. Hostiles UAV circling. Next door. Hostiles are separated. Hard point is secure. Point is secure. <coughs> I'm testing hard point. Hard point lost. Lord requesting hard point lost. support. We've lost our hard point. Hard point is secure. Q stores open. Hard point contested. Hard point located. Mission clock is running dead. Hostiles have the hard point. Chopper overhead. To the victor, the...